Now, a uh, registry of companies, Yuma Mawari, has revealed that payment of locked up funds of Black Shield Fund Management customers, formerly Gold Coast, cannot be made unless it secures liquidation order from the courts. The customers picketed uh, the premises of the Securities and Action Commission last month, demanding full payment of their funds. But speaking on PM Express Business Edition, Owari said all is being done to ensure that customers receive their funds. With Black Shield, the only issue is it is still in court. Why have Why? it kept so long? Man? Yes, because um, the owners of Black Shield are fighting the official liquidator in court. They do not want to be liquidated. And the bailout package was such that we can only is issue out that package to creditors or you know, investors in, who invested in the fund management companies, if only we get the uh, official liquidation order. And we still have not got the official Why liquidation order. Why haven't you order. got it? I mean, it's still in court. It's back and forth. The court processes, we, we petitioned the court based on the directive from Securities and Exchange Commission that Black Shield was not able to pay its creditors as mm -hmm. it fell due. And that is the, the stand up on which we went. And truly, up till now, they've not been able to pay all these investors who were, mm -hmm. you know, picketing mm -hmm. at the Security and Exchange Commission. And of course, the government wanted to ensure that the capital market was not, you know, shaken. I was with you at that time. That's why they brought about the bailout package, you know, scheme. So many of those fund management companies that I was able to, you know, operate with, we, we had liquidation orders before I could call for the creditors meeting. Mm -hmm. I had all those meetings and we had a whole plan in place of how they could get their monies. And I was able to pay tier one cash and tier two is now with GCB Capital. Mm -hmm. So that aspect is gone. I just have Black Shield remaining because the courts have not been able to give the official liquidator the order to liquidate it. So when they go and pick it at SEC, it's not really going to help. And even, I mean, the point is, I need the liquidation order to kickstart the bailout package. Some exciting news. You can complete your business registration with issue certificate within an hour from the first quarter of next year. Uh, the register of companies is set to roll out a new system from next year that should fully automate its entire operations. Listen to Jemima Wari again. So, but with the current system that we have, if only you also comply with our requirements. Because some will come and haven't even filled the forms. Some will come and they don't have a digital address. Some will come, they don't have an NIA card. So the key thing is, let's start counting from the time you complete all the requirements. And then we can say confidently that within a day, we can give you the business registration certificate. The issue in reality, though, is that the current software has challenges. Mm. And nobody denies that fact. Mm. And so you could come in and do everything within the day, but you won't get it within the day because possibly the system has shut down for one reason or the other, or one of the users of the uh, system, maybe the lawyer or the company mm. inspector, does not approve it within the time they're mm. supposed to approve it because there are so many other things that are being done. And that is why we are now going to move a step further and come up with a new software. We are trusting God before the end of this year, but looking at June, June is a bit short to mm. the end of the year. Early, early, early of next year, 2024, we are coming up with a new software which would enable you to do everything online. Mm. You would not uh, need to walk into our offices with paper as currently people are walking in and queuing at the bank to pay and scan and you know all those things. It would be a thing of the past. Mm.